This is a demonstration of the Bluetooth connectivity of the BBC Microbit. I've done two things before starting the recording of this video. I've installed the Microbit app on my iPhone. You can see it on the right here. There are versions for iPhone and also for Android. And I've also deleted any prior connections between my phone and my Microbit, any prior Bluetooth connections. Uh, so here we go. And the first thing that we do is use the Bluetooth app to pair the micro bit. You press and hold the A and the B buttons and then with another finger press the reset button until you get this Bluetooth symbol and then you get a funny bar graph which is unique to your micro bit. If you connect the top end of each bar it will copy that onto your phone. Then you click next Sometimes you need to press the A button, I didn't need to, so I went straight on to next. And now it's trying to pair, pairing request on my phone, which I click go ahead. And it says pairing successful. There's a tick on the micro bit. It tells me to press reset, so I press that. I'm getting a message up, that's from a previously installed program on micro bit. So next what I want to do is put some code on. I'm going to select sample monitor services from the uh, menu and select flash and now it's going to connect to my micro bit. You can see it connecting, discovering and now it's starting to flash that code onto the micro bit. When that's complete you get a message on the micro bit and we click OK. So now I'm going to show you the program I've just installed. If I click the monitor and control, uh, you can see the buttons A and B on the phone if I have to click start. And here we go, A and B. I'm going to add some other um, functions. You can't see them on this, but this is the accelerometer. This is the tilt one. If I tilt my micro bit to the left, you can see I get a negative number. And if I tilt to the right, I get a positive number, maximum of 90 for 90 degrees. So that's the accelerometer. I'm going to try another function. Again, you can't see it because it's whited out. So this is the LED function. If I select some dots on the phone and then click show, you can see they appear on my micro bit. So that's showing you connectivity in both directions from the micro bit to the phone and from the phone to the micro bit. You can also put in words. This uses the keyboard. I've put in the word hello, click show, and you can see H-E-L-L-O appears on the micro bit. This app's not very well designed, so the only way to get rid of the keyboard is to click home and, and go back. Last app that I've added is the temperature app. This is actually the temperature of the processor. Uh, to get a real temperature, you need to add a temperature sensor. And if I turn it over, the processor is on the left here. It says it's 27 degrees. If I put my finger over it, it's going to warm up just a little bit. It's warmed up to 30 degrees there. And that's it. So you've seen how data can be transferred from the micro bit to the phone and from the phone to the micro bit using Bluetooth.